Okay, so then welcome back to my second part of this repeat until statement. Okay, if you watch my first video, we have turn on the LED number 2 until LED number 13 with an interval of 0 0.1 seconds. It takes us 25 lines of codes in order to do that. This time around, we are going to simplify the codes into only 7 lines. Okay, we are going to use one of the most useful statement in coding is called repeat until okay how to do that of course first we have to go into this online and blog okay okay make sure we go to this ide.mblog.cc forward slash hash forward slash at first we are going to be presented with the screen. Okay, I want you to press as usual. You have to press devices. We don't want this code. Just press X. Delete. And then we have this add button. One of the list is I do not uno. I want you to double click or click twice on I do not uno until you have this. So the first part is ready for you okay the next step is we are going to assign variables okay how to do that before we do the assignment of variable let us do the simpler part first okay the most important block is this when I do know Uno starts up. We have learned this before. And then we have to go into pin. We set digital pin. This, this thing is used to turn on and off the LED. High is on, off is low. Okay. And we are going to wait for 0 0.1 seconds okay this one is usual we already know this thing but this time around we have to press variables it's below operators okay you can see this below this operators in green dot okay there is variable below, below this operators you just press this, this thing variables and, when, and then I wanted to make a variable. Just press this thing. And we name the variable as A. We can name it anything that we like uh, as, as long as it is meaningful. But I want to make it simple. We just make it as A. Okay. Alright. And we have all of this. Make sure we have this A. Set A to 0 and all that. In orange color. And then I want to set the value f of a into 2. Okay, I just dra drag this thing into here, above here. Alright, we have this over here. I want, to set, I want you to set a to the value of 2. Okay, that means a equal to, just like in maths, we can assign values to an alphabet. Okay, this time around, I want to assign the value of a as 2. So that's why I put it to. Why? Because in Maker Uno, the LED start at 2. We cannot use 0 and 1 because there is no LED that is connected to 0 and 1. So, what's next? Okay, I want to change the value of 2, A, by 1. We want to increase the value of A by 1. That means 2 plus 1 is equal 3. Alright? Change A by 1. That means, in other words, add 1 to A. Add 
1 to A. Okay, A, initially, we assign A as 2. When we change A by 1, that means we are going to add 1 to the value of A that is 2. That means it's going to be 3. Okay, do you understand this? This one, you, you must understand this carefully. At first, the value of A is 2. Then we add 1 to the value of 2. Okay? That means, originally, A is 2. We change A by 1. We add 1. That means, altogether, the new value of A will be 3. Okay? This is the most important thing that you understand. Okay? Be careful. Okay, the next thing is, we want to repeat the whole thing until 14, okay? Until this value of A become 14. So, we use this control. And we have this repeat until. Okay, this is repeat until. And I want I wanted to put it here. So these three line, these three blocks should be inside this repeat until. Okay. And I want to repeat until the value of this A become 14. So I just press this operators and then we have these blocks the equal blocks okay I just put it over here all right okay okay make sure you really know these steps you go into operators choose this equal sign and drag it into this blocks okay repeat until blocks okay and you have this here okay and i want you to change this value into 14 okay all right and then after this i want you to go back into this variables press variable below this operators and one and I want you to drag this A into here. So what this means? Okay, let me answer your question. We are going to repeat all these three things, set digital, weight and change until the value of A become 14. So let me explain it one by one. Okay. And then of course we have to put this below here. Alright. Okay. First, the value of A is 2. And then we are going to repeat this 3 blocks set digital weight and change until it become 14 okay at first the value of a is 2 so is it for is it 14 yet no it's not 14 yet so this thing this set digital weight and change we keep on going okay because the value of a is not 14 yet the value of a is still 2. Okay. So, we set digital pin. Okay, I want I wanted to set this thing as A also. We go into variables, press variables. And then, I wanted to drag this A into here. Alright. Okay. Hi. So, repeat until A equal 14. Okay. Set digital pin A 
A is what now? A is 2 because initially we set it to the number 2. A is 2. Okay. Output as high. That means we turn on the LED. A equal to output as high. That means A is 2. That means we are going to light up the LED number 2 because the current value of A is 2 now. And then we wait for 0 0.1 second. We change A by 1. That means we add 1 to the value of A that is 2 now. So, so that means it's going to be 3. Okay, this thing is going to be repeated again. Repeat until. Okay, until you can see here. Repeat until. Beside this repeat until we have A equal 14. Is A equal 14 yet? No, it's still 3. Because we add 2 plus 1 is equal 3. So this thing is going to be repeated again. Now the value of A is 3. Wait for one second. We change by 1. That means we add 1 to the value of 3. It's going to be 4 now. We repeat it until A equal 14. Is A equal 14 yet? No, it's still 4. So it's going to be repeated. Okay? A is equal 4 now, 0 0.1 seconds, and A by 1. That means we add 1 to the current value of A that is 4. It's going to be 5. And it's going to be repeated again. Is it A equal 14? No, it's still 5. So this thing we build will be repeated until A become 14. Okay? When this thing become 14, this 3 codes will be stopped. Why 14? Because the last LED is 13. So we want these three codes to run until 13 only. So set digital pin 13, okay, LED 13, and then it will go into this repeat until and it will evaluate. It's still 14 yet? No, okay. The thing will still be, be run, it's still be executed. Okay, and then when we increase the A into 13 plus 1 is equal 14, and then it will go into this repeat until is A equal 14? Yes, because we add 1 to 13. So when it becomes 14, there is no LED 14 in Mecca Uno. So this, the whole thing will stop. So let us count how many codes that we have. 1, when Arduino Uno start up, set A to 2, repeat until, set digital, wait, change. Okay, we, and this looping. Okay, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Okay, we include this arrow too. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. That's how... We save. We save a lot of codes. Instead of trying five codes, we only use seven codes to do the same thing. Okay. Thank you very much. I hope you can understand this thing because this is the important concepts in programming.